Hi guys, I am doing a little rearranging here in my house. You've seen some of it, but I thought that I would share with you my top 10 tips for creating a perfect vignette. One would be choose a style. Would that be the style of your home or for the season? And it's okay to mix styles. example I like to mix uh, country country French country farmhouse with shabby chic so those actually mix really well together but that's just me number two I have a two or three color rule and I can vary within those three colors Per room two or three colors and I will stick with those colors throughout the room and that creates harmony number three create an anchor piece always choose something to be your anchor piece the main focal point now if that is in shelves or something you can create a focal point within each shelf and have that be the main focus. With my two or three color rule, I do that with focal points as well. I could have up to two or three main focal points, especially if I'm working in shelves. Number four, always choose a variety of sizes and shapes. and a lot of things to look at. Not something that you're just gonna pass by and you could name everything that's there, but something that's gonna cause you to look at it and admire. Number five, choose things that will bring height and variety such as boxes or books. have to be always just, especially books, they don't have to be just placed on a shelf. They can be used as risers for anything else. Number six, always use at least one natural element. lots of greenery and lots of plants in mine. Uh, you can also use florals or moss. Number seven, always choose things that feel comfortable to you and your style. Don't feel like you have to follow someone else's guidelines or rules, even these. Choose things that you feel comfortable with. You will know within yourself. Placing things uh, on a table, on a shelf, you will know if it needs something added or if it's got too much or if it's just right. You will know that. Trust your own instincts and it'll turn out perfect every time. Number eight, use a triangle in your mind or any shape that creates balance. triangle because if you've got something here, something here, something here, it's got a balanced feel to it. But it doesn't necessarily have to be a triangle, but you're looking for a balance in everything that you're placing. The little things don't matter. It's the bigger anchor pieces that you want balanced. Number nine, you can always use boxes, trays as practice pieces and just to do smaller vignettes, you can move that tray or box anywhere 
and you have your boundaries within that box. So it's a little easier to practice within those boundaries and just arranging those things. And like I said, you can move it anywhere. Number 10, you choose your pieces with new eyes. Don't feel like you have to use something in the traditional way that it was made to be used. You can always use things in different ways and that creates such interest and that's going to really bring your vignettes to life. Make them your signature pieces for your home. So, I hope you guys like these 10 tips and if you try them, let me know. Have a great day. Bye-bye.